In medical news tonight, glaucoma warnings and what you need to do when your eyes are in danger. Andrea Boyle joins us with the details in tonight's health and medical checkup. Andrea. Rob, glaucoma affects 3 million Americans, and according to the Glaucoma Research Foundation, only about half of those people even know it. A nationwide charity is focusing in on glaucoma awareness, and here with more is optometric physician Larry Wallace. Welcome. Thank you for being allowing me to be here. So tell me first about the program you're involved in and its intention. Doctors of optometry like myself from the Camden Eye Center recently took part in All Eyes on the Family. It's a joint project uh, funded by the Lions Club International Foundation, the charitable arm of Lions Clubs International with 1.3 million members nationwide, and Allergan Corporation, a company that deals with medical pharmaceuticals for both uh, treatment of disease in general, eye care in particular, uh, with emphasis on glaucoma. Their uh, glaucoma medicine, Lumigan, is one of the first lines of defense, along with Travitan and Zalatan, to make it easier for patients to take their medicine. Well, before you get to that point, what should people know about glaucoma and the, the risk factors and the symptoms? Well, most of the time there aren't any symptoms, but glaucoma is a disease, a group of diseases characterized by damage to the optic nerve. When the nerve, through one reason or another, uh, has pressure which rises, the fluid that's normally made in the eye can't escape. The fluid rises, puts pressure on the nerve, cuts off the circulation to the nerve, damages the support structures to the nerve so that the nerve slowly dies. When this happens, blindness results, but blindness results slowly and with most of the time no symptoms. And that's why it's so important to have early detection and treatment. So who is most at risk? Older population? Not only the older population. Those over 60, uh, Afro-Americans, older Hispanics over 60, those with diabetes, uh, nearsightedness, myopia, those on steroids as well as those with previous traumatic disease and certainly those with elevated pressure. A lot of people. Thank you very much for joining us. Good advice for everyone at risk. And